fraction we will learn about fractions what are fractions and what are their types so let us begin let us learn first what a fraction is a fraction is a part of a whole now the question is what is a whole when we have one thing we say we have a whole for example here we are having a slice of orange and this is called a whole now if i will divide this slice into two equal parts then i got two parts of this slice now each part represents 1 by 2 and this 1 by 2 represents the fraction half now here in the fraction 1 by 2 the one which is written on the top is called numerator and 2 which is written in the bottom is called numerator and here the line between 1 and 2 this line is called division line now if i divide this orange slice into four equal parts then i get four equal parts of this slice and each part represents the fraction 1 by 4 now here 1 by 4 represents the fraction 1/4 now let us learn about types of fractions first one is proper fraction now what is a proper fraction a proper fraction is that fraction in which numerator is smaller than denominator it means the number written on the top is smaller for example we are having the fractions 3 by 7 8 by 11 and 1 by 4 you see here in each of the fraction the number written on the top is smaller than number written under it see in 3 by 7 3 is less than 7 in fraction 8 by 11 8 is less than 11 in fraction 1 by 4 1 is less than 4 now next time improper fraction a uh, improper fraction is that fraction in which numerator is bigger than denominator it means the number which is written on the top is greater than number written under it for example we are having the fractions 9 by 2 17 by 5 and 5 by 3 here in the given examples in every fraction the number on the top is greater means bigger than the number written under it see in fraction 9 by 2 9 is bigger than 2 now next time let us learn about like fractions like fractions are those fractions in which denominators are same it means the number in the bottom of each fraction will be same for example we are having the fraction 29 by 3 17 by 3 and 5 by 3 here you know down in each of the fraction we have 3 in the denominator so these three fractions are called like fractions we can have some more examples of the like fractions let us take the fraction 1 by 5 2 by 5 and 101 by 5 these three fractions are also called like fractions because here in each fraction we are having 5 in the denominator now after this let us learn what are unlike fractions 
unlike fractions are those fractions in which denominators are different it means those fractions in which denominators are not same for example we are having the fractions here 2 by 13 7 by 5 and 5 by 8 here in these three fractions all the denominators are different now let us learn about unit fraction unit means one so those fractions in which we have one in the numerator are called unit fraction example 1 by 2 1 by 3 and 1 by 5 these all the fractions are called unit fractions because we have here one in numerator now let us learn about mixed fraction now what a mixed fraction is a mixed fraction is a combination of a whole number and a proper fraction let us have the a uh, few examples of mixed fractions so we are having the fractions 2 into 1 by 2 4 into 3 by 5 and 5 into 2 by 3 you see here in this fraction 2 into 1 by 2 here 2 is a whole number and 1 by 2 is a proper fraction so this 2 into 1 by 2 is a mixed fraction next in the fraction 4 into 3 by 5 4 is a whole number and 3 by 5 is a proper fraction so again Here we are having mixed fraction. Thank you.